Vicki Halsey, and with Mike Song and Tim Barres. Our book is The Hamster Revolution, How to Manage Your Email Before It Manages You. So what inspired Tim, Mike, and I to write this book was to really make a difference in the lives of the people in organizations who are trying every day to do their best and serve as many people as they can and achieve the organizational goals. And what we realized was email seems to be sucking the life out of people, that it's keeping people from doing sometimes what they really need to be done, you know, what really has to be done for the organization to thrive. And with people getting over 18,000 emails, sending and receiving a year, taking a couple minutes each, a huge amount of time is invested in email. So the hamster revolution really targets three areas. One, it's to reduce the quantity of the email. Two, to increase the quality of email. And three, to coach others to help us all save ourselves. So the first one is has to do with reducing the quantity. And what we don't realize is for every five email we send, we get three back. So if you send less, you get less. It's kind of a boomerang effect, you know? The more you send, the more come back at you. So we have a one, two, three model for, for really determining, is it really necessary? Is it professional? You know, that we really want people to take a look before you send your email. You want to picture the busiest person you know and think, would they really appreciate this email? And we get reports back all the time from our clients. You know, exactly, because we do a pre and post survey that they reduce their quantity by 20% just by using the one, two, three method. There's two parts to improving the quality of your email. The first part is strengthening the subject line. People forget that the subject draws you in. Well, the subject line should be exactly what you want by when and have a very specific descriptive title. And that descriptive title is something like delivery. For me, it might be Vicki's PowerPoint slides for upcoming presentation. It might be request, please send your numbers, March numbers, to me by five o'clock Friday. But the goal of the subject line is to give the brain an instant focus of why you're sending the email. Then when you open up, it has a nice opening, we call a brief warm greeting, seven words or less, and then action, background, close. We move the action up front because the brain remembers what it sees first, last, and then in the middle. And what do most emails do? They send it and they do a bunch of blub blub and then they say what you want and then blub blub some more. So the idea is really to move the action up front. Help people to really consolidate, prioritize, know what to do by when so they'll start getting it done and it stops weighing on us. And it's, it's, it's kind of peaceful and you, you, you picture organizational life today. It's not peaceful, it's very chaotic, a lot of anxiety. And that's what drew me in and the relationship with Tim and Mike, their amazing work in this arena and then linking it to the need for organizations to streamline you know, their, their sharing of information and the data storage. It's been, it's been incredibly beneficial for organizations.